Hello, this is Melinda Phelps, your Timeless Beauty Specialist. As I always say, you can never be too young, too sexy, too glamorous, or too skinny. I'm sitting outside on my back porch this afternoon in, in the Texas heat, and it is pretty darn hot, so I won't take but a few minutes of your time. But today, I want to visit with you about the skin's aging and what the sun's rays have to do with that. You know, there are two forms of aging, intrinsic and actinic. Now, intrinsic aging, in reality, is only 10% due to the natural aging process. We're all going to experience that. Actinic aging unbelievably accounts for 90% of the visible signs of aging. And that's due to the sun and the elements. Now, that's why I want to visit with you about the sun's rays. And there are three forms of, of sun's rays. UVA, UVB, and UVC. I'm going to start with UVC, and these rays do not penetrate to the earth. The ozone layer stops them. They are deadly rays to humans in any form of life on earth. So that's why so many people are concerned about the ozone layer, because they are so deadly. Um, UVB rays, the B stands for burning, and that's what causes skin cancers. They are a medium-length ray and they actually do penetrate through the ozone layer and they bounce off of our skin's uh, surface though. Now UVA rays, they actually penetrate through the ozone layer but they also penetrate through our skin's surface and then just that destroys collagen and elastin and collagen and elastin is what gives our skin support and structure. Um, this causes wrinkling, sagging, and aging. So when you look for protection, look for a very broad sunscreen that includes UVA and UVB protection. Um, you want to make sure that it absorbs the light as well as reflects it. So it's very, very important to have that type of protection. So if you need any more information on sun protection or aging, please uh, click on the link or visit my website at melindafeltz.com, and that's M-A-L-I-N-D-A-F-E-L-T-S.com. Thanks so much for stopping by, and y'all come back now, you hear?